what up to I want to talk about the product of participation and what I mean by that is though we might not perceive ourselves as participating in events that really can come off as being evil and wicked and in truth we are participating in these events either directly or indirectly or conspicuously or inconspicuously I mean you look at the fact that okay you see my hoodie it says Nike I am a product of participation because I don't know what Nike is doing overseas. I don't know how they treat their workers um, overseas. So me going out and buying this product or anyone even buying a product for me, because it still doesn't matter because I'm wearing it and I'm participating in it, I'm still uh, generating this negative form of karma because I'm supporting not fully and not um, intentionally, but unintentionally and as well as uh most people can say unconsciously uh participating in something that's treating these people under these circumstances and i mean yes we're not doing anything directly but we're participating and we're all victims of it everyone on this earth is pretty much a victim of this um because you can really consider all of us to be parasites but there's denser form parasites and you have less denser forms of uh parasites you have to really give back in order to, let's say, erase your, your debted karma to the universe. And that's either you know passing information along or you could say coaching or trying to be a, not necessarily a teacher or instructor to just teach people, but to get people to look inside themselves. That's how you really, in my, in my opinion, really get rid of that or try to, uh, let's say, subtract that, that negative, negative karma because our because of the fact that we're participating in this in this these events that are, have have occurred and are going to continuously occur if we do something about it. So, we are products of participation. We do participate in almost everything. I mean, even when I was uh eating meat, I was participating within the conditions of the animals in which they were suffering. So, I'm not getting off as being a good guy. And I'm not uh, going to generate so much good karma. I'm generating negative, negative karma because I'm participating. And I'm saying indirectly and silently that, well, I didn't do anything to them. And I'm not speaking about it. But the fact that I'm eating this or the fact that I, when I used to do that, um, I participated and I generated that. It's just the fact that you can still be vegan and you could look at, okay, where does your fruit and vegetables come from? I mean, you could say South America, majority of the time, well, in the case of your, of your tropical fruits, the conditions that they're then subjected to, we're still participating in that. So we have to try to find a way to uh, subtract that negative, negative karma in order to uh, attain uh, more balance and try to achieve positive karma. Because the universe works in balance. It's not an imbalance mechanism. It has to be in balance. But the world that we've been conditioned to is in balance. And we have to bring about balance within there. And then we can do that just by helping each other out and to start considering all factors of people and trying to uh, treat each other the, the, the way you want to be treated. And growing up, I used to think that was such a cliche. I'm like, oh, man, I get tired of hearing that. But it, it's really truth behind that statement. So just start thinking about that and being aware of what you're participating in because we're all participating in this event. In this experiment but you have to be acknowledgeable about it and as well as uh be humble about it so all right peace out